never let Sean pick your accommodation. Because it tends to be very basic, very smelly. <sighs> but at least very cheap. I'm sure. We're just about to start day two. So I hope day two um, brings a little bit less pain and a hell of a lot less gardening. Right, better get some trams this one. So we start up day two. Uh, day one, uh, it kind of went okay. Paul's uh, forward launching now and running and managing to control wider. I'm kind of at the same part as well. Sometimes I'm running down the hill, managing to glide well, other times not so well, but I guess consistency comes with practice. You have to hold the cabin higher and you don't see your chin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so it's day two. Damn it. Atkinson, damn it. So let's do a transition. Yep. Let's go back again, please. So have you noticed every time you turn back, you pull on that one brake? Right. Yeah. On Must be your left hand, yeah. yeah. So let's let's get the lighter. Let's let's get moving backwards. Walk backwards. Walk backwards. Okay. Turn now. Keep walking backwards. Okay. his thing on my leg. Get your thing off my leg. Get it off. Get, get it off my leg. Give it his lipstick will be coming out in a minute. Yeah. Get it. Get, don't touch me with your tackle. This is uh, day two. And it's been really good this morning. I'm gonna go, go home, go back to work. It's not fair. Uh, but lots and lots of uh, practice uh, forward launching, um, controlling the, the canopy. Uh, so really enjoyed that. It's, uh, it's a beautiful place to do it as well. Very open, 
freezing in the morning, it, roasting the afternoon. Uh, but a good group of people as well. Do I have to come home? So that's the end of day two. So what have we done on day two, apart from get beat to death in the sun? Um, so a lot of ground handling. Um, I seem to have got that knobbed now. Forward launching uh, is going well. Um, and reverse kiting as well. That's been going really well. So I kind of got that mastered last thing this afternoon. Sorry you didn't get much video. It's been difficult to get some video. Um, shout out to Nathan. The mate, I promise you I would do for... Uh, for helping today listen I've been in the uh, trike as well and Nathan's been pushing me up and down the field uh, he's a trainee instructor uh, and he's been pretty bloody awesome um, so cheers Nathan thanks for all the help right so back to the hotel for a pear cider that sounds gay back to the hotel for a beer see you soon well morning so it's day three of uh, paramotor training and I've got to admit I'm feeling pretty beaten up now the calves are hurting hands are hurting biceps are hurting um, anyway here we are so Paul's now left so I'm all on my own uh, what the plan's supposed to be today so Matt Fox is the instructor he said to me due to the fact that um, running up and down a field all day with a, a glider behind me and a motor on my back could be uh, particularly physically exhausting he's recommended uh, getting most of the training done on the wheelbase initially uh, just to get all the flight skills takeoffs landings uh, air skills those kind of things and then once i'm comfortable with all that we'll switch back to running around on the ground uh, he reasons that there's a lot of things to learn all at once and if I'm being impeded by puffing and blowing and being out of breath I'm not going to pick the other skills up so quick so we are going to do some wheelbase training um, but we are switching to foot launch later on in the course which is good okay I, I trust what he's saying so anyway better get my flight suit on well, a quick catch up it's day three it's the morning of day three I'm sat in a quad not the quad that you ride on the road but the quad that you sit in and fly um, because I'm going to start my training with wheelbase as I mentioned before um, so they're going to be towing me in this behind um, a motorized quad because the golf cart's got a flat tire which you normally use as two that's not the normal driver so if you tow me with the quad I can control the glider with the fly. That's that phase completed. I've been uh, dragged around in the quad aircraft, uh, wheelbase based aircraft, towing a paraglider behind us uh, to get control of the paraglider. I've had two runs, uh, and both runs went really well. The only problem is uh, it's a bit difficult getting towed. You can't kind of do turns without watching what the guys doing who's towing you and trying to concentrate on the paraglider so now they are going to give me the wheelbase trainer which is like a, um, a paragliding quad except it doesn't have a propeller it has an engine so it's kind of a, a cart and uh, 
Uh, I'm going to drive that round, pulling a guider, and seeing if I can control it and taxi it. And if I can, then maybe we can fly. Maybe. Fingers crossed.